there it is. This is where the survivors said that they were defending. I don't hear any gunfire though. There's a dead body there as well. Wow, one, yeah. He crawled over. Died in a pool of his own blood. But, uh. Oh, yeah, more survivors. That guy was a bandit back there. Had a pretty good defensive bus, but didn't help them. But yeah, these survivors, they uh, sent out an SOS call on the server and uh, said I'd be there because these bandits were, uh, were coming for their leader. Because uh, they own this little town here, they defend it. And uh, their leader took a, uh, took a gunshot not, not so long ago, so they've been in a been on the med bed. Oh yeah, more med dead bodies. I don't think there's any bandits here now, but they must have got away with it. But yeah, the bandits have come for their leader and uh Yeah, this guy. This was head of security right here. God damn it. Well, I'll go check out the uh the medical area, see if anyone's still alive. That's a truck. That sounds like a year of just leaving. Just started the engine up. survivor left alive. I'm going to have to track these bandits down and uh, hopefully rescue that, that survivor. center of Cherno because uh, there's a military camp here and uh, I want to try and get a better weapon than this AK I've uh, picked this one up because it had a bit more ammo but I kind of want to get like an M4 or something something a bit more accurate at range but there is a military camp here and uh, well it is the center of Cherno so it's not really the place I want to just about to say it's not really the place I want to be <laughs> uh, that's looked like that tracer came from over there it's got a pretty nice scope on this though to be fair it didn't come from the top I'm pretty sure it came from the bottom oh there he is one kill <laughs> that guy wasn't very good could have killed me there. I was poking right out. Right. Oh, you know, I got a friend. <laughs> that was a genuine reaction right there. <laughs> uh, okay. So, always suspect they've got a friend. Hmm. I think that came from. Yep, clock tower. Classic spot. No. I could try and peek him here, I guess. Pretty sketchy, though. The problem is, this scope's not very good for when he's like right there. I'm going to try and get a different angle. 
Close but no cigar, my friend. Second target down. <laughs> I don't know how he didn't hit me there. That was insane. I had to aim so low. But, uh, two kills. Just being cautious because there was two of them there. You know, there always could be a third. They had a pretty good defensive line. One guard, one on this. One on the ho uh, one on the hotel and one up there. There is a pub over there that somebody could get into there. Let's move up slowly. Don't even know how that guy got on there. How, how would you even do that? Advanced movement, maybe, up the ladder. I don't know. But uh. These guys were pretty basic bandits, to be honest. They, uh, they're not wearing the um, militarized bandit uniform, which you know only the good guys get, like the, the really, the really good players in the bandit faction. These guys were pretty basic, I think. But uh, they probably, well, they could have been part of it, or they could have been part of the, like on their own sort of rogue bandits. Well, no loot, really. Either way, though, they were no match. Ow. Ooh, what is that? There's an M16. I will have that. Picatinny rail, nice. In a, ooh, what's that? Flashlight. We'll have that, too. Got some pretty basic gear, to be honest. A lot. Nice. Now that is handy. And we'll take that. That is a bandit headdress. Probably left by one of these guys. Probably didn't want to wear it. But, uh. Is there any gear in there? Where is the lack of gear? Well. Wow. But, uh. Yeah, and I was probably left by one of them guys. And uh, that's going to be pretty useful for me. Because uh, it means that when the time comes, I can sneak into the bandit stronghold. And uh, pretend to be a bandit. Undercover. <laughs> and uh, rescue that survivor that they took. So I'm going to head up into the trees where I feel most at home. And, uh, yeah, we'll uh, sort out where we're going next. So, made it to the uh, northwest airfield. Saved you the, uh, the watching the uh, journey up here. Because you can't actually build a quad bike, so it's a long walk. But uh, I've had a scout out already of the airfield. There's actually a little bird down there, which concerns me a little bit. Uh, there is a barracks. Looks like the door's open on the far side. But uh, I've just been waiting to see if I can see anybody. It's the best thing to do in Daisy is just to, to sit and wait and see if you can make a move. Because if I can get down there un undetected, that'd be great. Because armor's all about the, the what ifs or the could I run into somebody or you know I could I could run down here and there could be a team of four running through the woods so it's all about the uh, it's all about being undetected in this game there's actually a barracks here as well Buildings on the far side. If 
fire station, what not. Let's give them a check. Don't see any campers or anything. Thing with the airfield is, anyone could be anywhere. There could be a sniper hiding in the trees over there. Sometimes you just gotta man up. Take that. I am disguised as a bandit, obviously. Just in case the uh, the bandit squad sees me, they might actually uh, back off. zombie. Go away. <sighs> that scared me. Thought that was a person that's going to absolutely flip. Zombies sound like people. <laughs> What's that? Dirty bandage. Oh, I'm getting hit. Uh oh. Uh oh. We might. Are we good? I'm gonna have to get out of here. Sorry, zombie. Not today. Status uh, health scan 98. You seem to be okay. We're not infected, I don't think, either. Oh, no, no. I would take these guys out, but I've only got an assault rifle. Another couple of boxes down here as well. Hell no. I might have to take these guys out and then move off. zombie. Well, spaghetti's gonna put my health down. We can't eat, but 
Oh, a pistol. That will actually come in handy. Ow. An AKM. I'll take that. I might need to heal. Uh, we'll just use a bandage. Sterilized bandage. this quick now that we've just uh, fired a shot Ooh, range finder nice upgrade let's take this guy out as well Absolutely, make this quick now. Another one of them. I'll take that. The more the better. I think we can sell it. So. Ooh, a grozer. I'll take that. I think it's silent, so. It's a, it's a good thing. Right, let's get out of here. So, it looks like we've got a player out there. 329 meters. Don't know what the zeroing is on this. If it's standing, if it's standing still, it's a decent shot, but... I can't tell if he's a bandit at the moment. Looks like a normal player. Always being attacked by zombies. Just run, buddy, run. First human interaction I have seen on this server. So. It's night time. I uh, I logged out of the, the previous session and logged back in. And uh, I think we got some action on the airfield here. There's a guy snooping around at the back of here. I don't know what he's doing. But uh, just watching out from this bush. I uh, don't know if there's more than one guy, but I heard some shooting as I was logging in, so it's not, not always the best. But uh, these rangefinders have night vision, so that's better than some people. Because night vision is pretty hard to get on this server, I believe. I don't know where he's gone. He did snoop around the back, so maybe he's going to be on the wall. But, uh... Pretty sure he's going to turn up again. I want a good look at him before I uh, decide what to do. Mm. He looks like a survivor, to be honest. I don't really want to shoot him unless he gets too close. It's alright, he can't see me up here, so I'm pretty much secure. But I'll, uh, I'll just watch what he does. Um, the wolves are out. <laughs> but uh, if he gets too close, I might have to... Um, I might have to take him out. I don't know. We'll see. He 
He went into here and he hasn't come out again. I so. stumbled across what seems to be something burning over here. The, uh, the smoke is pretty faint, but something's definitely on fire. Or was. It's now smouldering. I did just run us straight across this field, which was kind of a bad move, but... You know, the more bold you are in this game sometimes, the better. Now, uh, something's definitely on fire over here. I'm really hoping this isn't a... Uh, what the bandits have done. Because I've uh, I've been hearing rumours that they've... Uh, that they've been stopping sort of survivor cars at checkpoints and uh, just throwing Molotov cocktails through the windows uh, with the survivors still in there uh, for no reason so I'm hoping this isn't that otherwise this could be a uh... wow the smoke is pretty thick now I really don't know what this is oh. it's a chopper Whew. okay this is probably a recent crash, to be honest. It's kind of sketchy. I should really take this a bit slower than I am. Just in case anyone is camping this. Now, I don't really know what kind of gear spawns at choppers like this. So I guess we'll find out. Whoa. Okay. Now that is definitely better than a grozer. <laughs> My goodness. And it's got one of the rockets as well. That is... Gr wow. Okay. I didn't realise this server had rockets and stuff like that on here. Just really checking it, making sure there's nothing else. I don't think there is. Wow, okay. Let's just get out of here, let's get out of dodge. My goodness. <laughs> The damage we can cause. Get down, get down, get down. Oh, damn it. Well, we have ourselves a car. truck went went past. Oh please stop. Well, it seems that uh my intel was sort of correct. Um I had a private message off a dude on the server saying there was some bandits over by this military camp. And they've got cars, choppers, and all sorts, so... I don't know where that other, that other car went now. There was definitely two, right? But uh, I think I think that was one of the bandits getting out of there. See, leaving the base. But uh, they've made a, they've made like a camp on the outskirts of the map here, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and find it and take it out. But, uh... Yeah. Uh, definitely more more activity around this area, so I wonder if he went to the dam. Don't know. Definitely more activity around this area, so we're getting close. That is a heli bopper.
pretty laggy. It's turning brown. Whew. Thank you, sir. Now this guy was a bandit. M4. Both of them. Wow. Let's see if I can get this guy's good gear. But I might get too close to the fire. Oh, there we go. Nope. Can I check his name? I can't. Well, I don't think I'll be able to repair that. I don't know how many people were there then. My goodness. Well, boys, don't land near me. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm actually, like, stunned right now. I have no more space for anything. Probably don't need the blood bag. My goodness, I don't know how many guys were in that then, but there's definitely two. I bet they're mad. They're so mad. It's unreal. They had so much good gear. Well, I need to sort out some of this gear. we are out of here boys <sighs> took down a bandit chopper <laughs> as if they landed right there oh my god that was the best rocket kill ever <laughs> oh I feel so bad for them they literally must have gone to the trader and bought so much gear